I came to that stand out of um, curiosity, but I was, I was wondering what is tech doing in agriculture? Agriculture is all about cutlass and hoes and, uh, and and tractor. You know, but I was a kind of uh, you know I was kind of impressed. You know, uh, because I've done a little bit of livestock. You know, and livestock is usually manpower intensive. It's usually difficult to really manage, you know, manage the movement of the cattle. Especially such hefty animals, right? So you know, so with this, you are able to identify where each animal is at any time. You're also able to identify how it moves around. So it gives you an indication of which animals are healthy, which animals are not healthy, and uh, you know, considering you're also able to measure the temperature, you know, so you are achieving a lot of things at the same time in a very, you know, in a very cost-effective manner. So I didn't know that these kind of things actually, you know, actually exist. And then the one for the, uh, for the moisture sensor, man, that is fantastic. You know, because irrigation is expensive, you know, and that is, um, you know, water is a scarce resource these days. So you don't want to over-irrigate, you know, you don't want to under-irrigate. under, under, under irrigate. So having something to monitor, and you don't want to go and check your moisture after the fact. So having something that tells you exactly how, you know, the results of that irrigation, real time. Man, that's, that's, that's fantastic. So it's not just that you save on water, all right? You know, you also irrigate effectively because overwatering is destructive. Underwatering, you will not get the best out of, you know, out of, you know, so, so I think it, will, it should maximize crop yield, you know, it should maximize, uh, you know, crop yield. So I like both. So I think, uh, I think overall it is really, you know, it is mind blowing to see that technology is now moving into agriculture. So I like the one for irrigation. You know, I, you know, like it is really, I think it's something that every large scale farmer should have. Especially in a place where water, you know, you need to pump water out of the ground, you know, it costs you to pump out the water. So, and also you need to maximize your crop yield. So I think it's something really worth, you know, worth looking at.